when Kayla first told me about Kyle, we were sitting in a restaurant and she's telling me about this guy that she met in Mexico. And I was um, a little bit skeptical because she met him on vacation and she's telling me about him. And I was like, okay, this is, there's something very different the way she's talking about this guy she met. She never talked about anybody else the way she's talking to me about Kyle. And when I actually met Kyle, I could see it. He really cared for Kayla. He could make her laugh on a dime. And I was like, all right, there's something here. As their relationship grew, it brought out the best of each other and one another. Until this day, it amazes me that she went to Mexico to find herself and found her other half. Kyle definitely completes her. He's very decisive and shares her sense of humor. And if anyone knows Kayla, making a decision is a struggle for her. And when Kyle asked her to marry him, it was the easiest decision I bet she's ever made. We as parents are really proud that we are we were able to raise some nice, nice kids. We call you kids, but very nice. Kyle, you're respectful of everybody. You're just nice to everybody. You have good common sense. You're, you're, you're a good man. I know that you love my daughter. Thank you. Kayla May. <laughs> we raise a nice young lady. She's respectful of people very much. And she's very polite. She loves people. And she can be funny. She can actually can be funny. <laughs> we love you. Kayla, we love you. Oh, I'm so beautiful. Let me see. Look at you. You look great too. Oh, look at that. Oh my god. Yes. Congratulations. In that still and settled place, there's nobody but you. You're where I breathe. You're where I see my view. And when the world feels full of noise, my heart knows what to do. It finds that still and settled place and dances there with you. Kayla, although our story has just begun, it is already written in chapters of love, laughter, and commitment. I vow to always make every effort towards writing our story to end in happily ever after. I will always love you, cherish you, protect you, and I will always be by your side through this wonderful story of ours. I love you. Now let's write our story. I never thought that taking a trip to Mexico would lead me on a path to finding my soulmate. Our relationship has been through many adventures already, from where we met, to dating long distance, to finally moving me 2,085 miles across the country. Never once did I question our love or commitment. I give you this ring as a symbol of my commitment. To love you today, tomorrow, always and forever. I now pronounce you husband and wife.
I am uh, the best man, Kyle's older and taller brother. And balder. Can't win them all, just like the Packers can't beat the 49ers. You can't win them all. Um, when we were kids, whenever we'd go camping, our sister got to invite whoever she wanted to come camping. But Kyle and I got told, no, 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 you can't invite friends, you have each other. But like as we've grown older, that relationship, those moments have turned into this relationship. I'm honored to be the best man. This is what it's turned into. I couldn't ask for a better, better situation, a better brother or anything. It seems the daylight knows this is our time. Good evening, everybody. My name is Jason, Kyle's best friend. Me and Kyle have known each other for quite a while. Uh, we met in first grade, so it's been going on about 26 years now. Uh, we've been through a lot, uh, grammar school, high school, into college, studying criminal justice together, and then now walk, walking our own beat. Uh, really saying he's my best friend is kind of a, an understatement. He's been more of a brother. Um, he's been part of my family, and I feel like I've been part of his. Kayla, I'd like to welcome you to the family. And I hope for the best for you too. I'd like to see you guys in years to come growing together. Um, congratulations. Forever star.